everyone Carol's here in her art room I'm gonna do another uh, attempt at a cloudy pour I'm using a record this time and I just laid down some white artist loft paint so I've got most of my paints done yellow cadmium yellow medium and light hue actually one's a cadmium yellow medium hue and one's a Artist Loft Yellow, which is lighter. I mix them both together. And also have a, this is, um, oh, what is this purple? Uh, Deco Art. And it's uh, opaque violet Deco Art. I mixed it with pouring medium, so I, no, I mixed it with Floetrol. So I've got um, uh, one and a half Floetrol, almost one and a half to two parts Floetrol to one part paint in this. And now I'm mixing up some Dioxin Purple, which is an Artist Loft uh, Level 2, like this one. I just cut the thing open to get the rest of the paint out. I'm almost out of this. It's called Violet Dioxin. This one is transparent. So I'm hoping with some opaque in here, other than the white, I just hope my purple doesn't sink again, or sink too much. I'll try and put the two purples together, maybe that will help. And the last one I did, my yellow kind of disappeared, but it mixed with the blue and made green, so that's okay. Okay. So, I'm just going to use this cup, but now I'm going to use my measuring cup. And I'll get another cup. I'm going to use this measuring cup, or sorry, this plastic cup. Um, I've mixed up some, uh, I have some house paint enamel which is like a beige color. And I've mixed it with Artist Loft White and some pouring, or sorry, and some uh, Floetrol. A little bit more water. And purples, purple, yellow, oh, and I have a little bit of orange that I'm gonna add. It's a ready orange. I might even add some red. And I'm gonna do it with a funnel. So this is very different. I was gonna use a cup and I forgot I'm gonna use a funnel. So we'll give this a whirl. So I'm gonna put this uh, Artist Loft and House Paint in the bottom. We need to fill this whole funnel. I'll put some of this violet. And then this dioxin purple. Give this a stir again. It looks like it thickened up. It needs to be a bit thinner.
And then I think I'll do the red. Red and purple. Look. Well, this is an orangey red. They look nice together. And then I'll put some yellow. I'm just going to put a little bit of this. fill this right up. I was going to put some more red. Oops. Oh. Lordy, lordy. Lordy, lordy. off my yellow trying to decide if I should just let it come out. I'll swirl it. I think I'll just let it come out and, and then I'll swirl it a little bit. All right, so now this. That's pretty full. Go for this, as Melly D says. If nothing else, it should be a nice pour. All right, I don't have to. Oh, that's a lot of white on there. Whoa, look at inside there. Whoa, look at that. That is awesome. Way too much paint. Whoa, I'm going to put this tray here and I'm going to let it go in the tray. Forgot to get the air bubbles out before. Maybe I'll... I love that lacing there. Wow. Hold it up. to the edge, pour a little off. I love this. I don't want to lose too much of this. I don't know. 
much to take off. This is awesome. I lost my yellow and my orange might pop up. I wonder if any cells are going to pop up. Just the edges have cells. This is lacing. I have w had way too much paint. So note to self, this whole funnel is a too much paint for that. Oh, I love these colors. Can't stop looking. I don't see too much popping through here, but it's mostly lacing. This is going to take a while to dry. Well, you know what? I'm just going to leave it and let it dry. It might take a while to dry this one. But this, these cells came out right away. Like right away. So I don't know what the enamel did, if anything. Alright, well, I'm going to let this sit for a while and see what happens and I'll come back. Okay? Okay. It's about 10 minutes or so later. Not much is changing. It's pretty much staying the same. I'll hold it up closer for you. I'm going to just leave it and let it dry. There's like quite a lot of paint on here. It's very cool. Anyways, come back for more uh, experiments. So this was uh, two different kinds of purple. The yellow is only here a little bit and the orange disappeared. But anyway, still came out nice. I like the lacing. I'll put the dried results at the end like I normally do. And check the description below and you'll see a link to our Facebook group that we have started, my sisters and myself, and uh, come by and share your photos. Please subscribe and uh, hit the bell for notifications, comment below, and come back soon to my art room. All right, have a great day. Take care. Okay, this is uh, some dried results. It's almost dry. It's, a, it's damp in the middle. There was a lot of paint on here. But I just thought I would show you because it's taking too many days. It'll just stay the same. It's drying smooth. Right here you can see. Alright. There you go. There's a close up of this. I love this kind of lacing. I don't know. It's different. Really different. Alright, thanks for coming by. Bye-bye.